Audemars Piguet is the latest watch industry heavyweight to start a secondary market program. By the end of this year, 2023, AP will introduce its own certified pre-owned watch selling program. This information follows Rolex's announcement of its certified pre-owned program in December 2022. Audemars Piguet CEO launched the plan at a premium recruitment conference in Paris and its uh, information was published over the last week by a European publication covering the luxury industry. And it appears that the program's planning has started in earnest. In addition, AP appears to be counting on the program to generate a sizable amount of revenue, which is not surprising given the exorbitant prices its Royal Oak watches fetch on the secondary market. The CPO business is going to be bigger than its new business. It will be fantastic news for wealthy people who might have lost their chance to purchase a Royal Oak in a retail store. And due to problems with supply and demand, buying the watches has become insanely difficult. In contrast to purchasing from a grey market dealer, the initiative will provide an authenticity guarantee so the customers may feel more secure about their purchase. And according to reports, the project's test phase will start around the end of 2023. The watchmaker has previously dabbled in CPO trading, and that was prior to the pandemic. It started a program, but it was later put on hold after it attracted criticism for selling the same watch again. However, AP has been collaborating with Material Good for some time. In addition to running the company's East Hampton, Dallas and Boston boutiques, and working with his AP house in New York City. Um, also independently sells authorized pre-owned AP timepieces. Furthermore, it appears that material good may play a significant role in the new CPO program. Of course, AP is already experiencing tremendous success. In 2022, revenue surpassed 2 billion euros, or around 2.17 billion US dollars. The launch of the new CPO program will occur at the same time as Benahamia's exit from the organization. The executive is expected to leave before the end of the year. By then, he will have worked for the business for 10 years, during which time he oversaw substantial marketing efforts that rekindled consumer interest in the brand. Particularly with the help of well-known celebrities like Mark Ronson, Kevin Hart, Serena Williams and LeBron James. He also played a key role in controlling distribution by abandoning wholesale accounts in favour of selling directly through AP-run boutiques. The CPO program will provide even another level of management over sales and brand perception. More than half of the market for pre-owned watches is reportedly made up of AP, Rolex and Patek Philippe. So, will Patek Philippe be next on the bandwagon? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below regarding this new news for AP doing certified pre-owned watches. Will it be a success? Let me know your thoughts. Was Rolex's authorized program a success let me know everything in the comment section below and be sure to subscribe to lux report click on the bell icon click to receive all notifications and check out our next video